Hey guys, uh, my name is Chris James and I wish all of you a very happy Chinese New Year. I am Chris James, I um, wrote the song Not Angry and I'm also singing on it. It just kind of blew up overnight and I don't know what happened. <laughs> Back then I got into a fight with my ex-girlfriend, now ex-girlfriend, um, and it was kind of more of a makeup song. It was, <laughs> I wrote it to, to kind of like, after, after our fight, I wrote a song about like us kind of making up. How did you know that it got famous in China? I uploaded it on YouTube and then all of a sudden I was getting comments in Chinese underneath the YouTube video. And I was like, what's going on? And it just got more and more and more. And I'm like, what's going on? So I started translating because I don't speak Chinese. So I, um, I translated it and found out that people are coming from a platform called Douyin, right? And, uh, and um, I, at that time, I didn't know what Douyin was. So I, I, did, I looked it up and then I looked, oh my God, okay, so it's blowing up on this platform. What is the sweetest message you'll get from um. Chinese fans? Um, I think the, the ones that I like the most are the tell me that how much the music helps them kind of relax <laughs> um, because because um, I had like some people that were like really really stressed out in their job or whatever in school and they're like yo your music really like just makes me relax and it's like really nice to to listen to your track. That's exactly what I intended when I wrote these songs. So it's like really nice for people to. And so there are not only your videos, but also like some uh, parody videos we say, like right. imitation, different people singing right. different styles of the song. Do you have any uh, impression on these songs? It's so cool. What I loved the most were the guitar tutorials where people are trying to teach other people how to play the song guitar because that's kind of how I learned to play guitar, so it's like really nice to see that kind of full circle moment. <laughs> it's very strange, like, making music for the internet at the moment, because it's like, all I get is messages. And it's like, I don't really see a person behind the song. I mean, I don't really see the people that are listening to the songs, which, which is sad, you know? But I also post a lot of that on social media, so like, I love kind of incorporating the fans in the process, and it's like really nice for me to also get feedback on an idea. Have you been reached out by any Chinese media or companies that they will invite you to China to do a show? Would you like to do that? Um, I, I mean, I would love to do that, totally. It's, for me, like all of the, all, everything that's happened ever since Not Angry has been like growing like that. Um, it's just, it's something that I would have never dreamed up. And like, I've, I've been in Germany for a lot of long time and it's like really hard for me to break here. And it's like, and now all of a sudden my music breaks somewhere else, it's completely different. I've never been there. So it's like super exciting and I would totally be down to do, do 